We're on week three of our mini body shape series videos here at Shepherds. This week we're working with Rosa. Rosa is part pear, part knot. She'll explain her own unique proportions to you. We'll give you a few tips that work for her and for everyone else. Let's take it away, Rosa. Hi, I'm Rosa and I'm the, what you will call half and half. I say that because I'm a pear in the bottom and at a broad shoulder on the top. Classically, a pair has a small, a narrow shoulder, small boobs, but it has the pair on the hips. I have a long torso like a pair, and then the shorter legs. We're gonna start by lengthening the leg line with a boot cut. So what's important here is that kind of triangle cone shape at the bottom of the leg stays, but we can proportion the pant to fit so that the hem should break on the forefoot. Darker color here is important. We're going to do a lot of structured seamed uh, tops here like this one in French Terry. See the seaming at the back as well is magical for Rosa. So now what about something that has no shape, but this is two thirds, one third dress and we'll talk more about that in an upcoming video. That's really good for any shape. We're gonna roll up the sleeve again to tweak. You see how the back just streamlines really, really nicely. The belt here adds that kind of peekaboo of waist, which is all that we need because we've gone tonal. So by tweaking, it really proportions her look. The one button blazer. So this should fit really nicely right below the bust line and it has to be fitted at the waist. So that's why Rosa would tweak this by repositioning the button. What's important here is that the length of the blazer is short. It just goes over the widest part of the hip. So an interesting way to cut across the width of a hip. Now we've gone for the long menswear blazer here. We've done that pop of color on top, but the accessories tell the story here that really soft little silk scarf that doesn't overcrowd the neckline, the pointed accents from the shirt and earrings are all that Rosa needs to really accent this look beautifully. Fit and flare, this is a piece from Simply. It is so good, it repositions the waist again from right under the bust line with the soft peplum. Accessories add the brightness and they're all short. In scale, Rosa is five foot three. Yes, we've gone cropped with a pant. However, it's a darker receding color and it fits from the hip and it just flows down as well. So look to uh, the fabrics, like this is a heavy jersey from Ripkoff to do that for you. But look at how we've got a monochromatic moment that looks so good. Here's how to strengthen the shoulder line in a flash. Add a scarf and work with it horizontally. That's creating that horizontal line that again rebalances the hip line so beautifully. This is when uh, the designer has done the work for you with the soft peplum from Frank Lyman. Notice the plissé on the bust line. So typically pairs have a smaller bust so they can do this accent so well. And again, the waist has been created for you. It just accentuates it all the more. You can do a longer pant with this. Would recommend more of a flared look. Now the dress. The strong print starts with a darker base the drape on the skirt is very important again because this is jersey and there is length it drapes down it doesn't add fullness to the hip line this is right out of the pair playbook thank you rosa for modeling this week's body shape tip is very simple it's very rare to find a garment that ticks off all of the boxes and that does its best from top to bottom to work for your shape so that's where you need to tweak it. So take a look in the mirror and see how you can adjust the sleeve, adjust the lapel, maybe adjust the color you're wearing underneath it to make it work for you. Remember, you're in the driver's seat when it comes to your own style and your own design. So wishing you a wonderful week. We'll see you next week for another mini body shape video.